was third in the world last year, you know, <laughs> like, uh, he was just tough. And I was like, wow, that's really good. <laughs> and so I feel like I'm on a real high and I'm feeling great about this tournament now. And, and I go out in the finals and I have this skinny Italian guy. And the guy obviously saw the last match because he doesn't want anything to do with me. He's like running around, but he's so long. He kept catching my wrist, reaching around, trying to trying to get my far hip. And he's just doing this little slide by and I can't get to his body. And I try and I try and I can't, like he's so long I can't get at him and eventually he runs me out of bounds. They, they go caution and one and I lose the match by a point. And I come off and like, ah, you know, I did. I had such a good tournament, and then I lose to this scrub in the finals. And yeah, but you know what? I'm having so much fun. I don't even care. And Ivan goes, "Hey, this is not so bad. This is the guy that took fourth. He lost. <laughs> he lost to the the Yugoslav." I'm like, oh, "All right." So you know that was pretty good. Um, and that was that was like a real kind of a peak in my life in a sense. Not not from the performance standpoint, but you know it was one of those times when. Everything was right, you know. I, I loved wrestling. I just wanted to go to tournaments all the time, and you know, it was back. It was as much fun as it had ever been, and uh, coincidentally, it was paying off too. I was really uh, performing, and then I went back to college. And even though I liked Iowa, it was still it's still college, you know. I mean, it's still um, you know, the season gets long, and you know, everything's dead serious, and you're going like, oh, you know, the NCAA's they're coming, and. Uh, you know, it just it just wasn't quite the same. Too so, pressure filled, you're saying. Well, they make it that way, you know. I mean, um, I, I half the time I think that there's a certain kind of personality where if you just like didn't train and went into the NCAA's, you'd probably win, you know. <laughs> like, you know, if they surprised you and said, "Hey, you know what? Uh, you know, NCAA's are tomorrow," you'd be like, "Oh, oh okay." Uh, you know, just go in and fight as hard as you can because that's what you've been trained to do since you were a kid, and. You know, you'd probably do better. Uh, I, I actually know a bunch of athletes right now that I could point out that, that are kind of like that, where I think that's more the atmosphere they need. In college, you know, all the dual meets, and it's like a big deal in your record and all this stuff. And it's that's not that's not the soul of wrestling to me. That I, I really, um, I mean, it's, it's not bad. It's it's good that we have the chance to compete like that, but um, it's not where my heart is, you know. Um, so there there's a long story. Um, and you can edit it down and put it on the internet. And people cannot watch it, and that's fine. <laughs> Ray, it yeah. was certainly a pleasure talking to you. Thanks, well, man. That's, I'm surprised. <laughs>